Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is use a little bit of non-stick cooking spray. This is like high grade cooking spray. So I'm just going to spray a little bit of this on my pan to get ready to start cooking my chicken. Also has zero calories, zero everything. So you can also use um, anything else you want to use or you can use uh, olive oil or butter or whatever. I'm just going to use that because it is the healthiest option. I'm going to use a tiny little piece of chicken. This is like a palm size amount. Really, really thin little piece from a breast that I cooked the other night. So I'm just going to cut this in kind of like little cube bite sized pieces, I guess. I'm just going to go and transfer this into my pan right now. I've switched to another cutting board and I wash my knife. Green pepper, red pepper, and red onion. Um, now, you can put whatever you want in it. If I had some broccoli, I would add broccoli. You can put in mushrooms, tomatoes, I mean kale, uh, spinach. This is the time where you can really, really just add whatever your favorite vegetables are. Um, if you're going to use frozen vegetables, try to um, drain them first because if they are frozen, the excess water will kind of make your uh, omelet watery. So fresh vegetables are usually the best option, but I have used frozen in the past. So I just cut up my vegetables in kind of similar bite-sized pieces. set my vegetables and chicken aside and I'm going to work on scrambling my eggs. I like a really big omelet that's going to keep me full and these are medium eggs so they're not too big so I'm going to use three and um, it's actually been proven through research that egg yolks actually help you burn fat and egg white omelets really don't do anything extra for you. So I'm just going to use the entire egg. Now, if you have, you know, heart problems or your doctor's telling you, you know, your cholesterol's too high, you shouldn't eat egg yolks, then that's obviously something you can um, omit. But eggs don't really have that many calories to begin with. They're like 40 to 60 calories each. So that's your whole breakfast, really. I'm going to add some salt. A little bit of cayenne and some black pepper. I'm going to add a drop of half and half. Let that coat the pan. And make sure it's on a really low heat. And now we're going to sprinkle our veggies and chicken mixture on top while the bottom is starting to cook and what I like to do is tilt it with the handle just to get the part that's not cooked moving around and get it cooking also gonna go in with a little mozzarella so because of that non stick spray you can see how perfectly my omelet is sliding around the pan so I'm going to flip it in half now.
open it, you get your veggies and your cheese. And then, you, and then you get the chicken. Yum. Mm. So good. And the red pepper really adds a nice sweetness, which adds flavor. You could add like a little adobo, garlic. I mean, you could really add any herbs here because that's not gonna add calories, it's just gonna add flavor. But it's really, really tasty for a healthy option. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And definitely leave um, some suggestions. Leave me some recipe requests down below. I'm gonna try to do as many cooking videos as possible for you guys because I know that you're always asking on Snapchat for recipes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you in my next video and bon appetit. <laughs> yum 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 yum. Mm.